Abdullah moved here when he was just 10 years old and has come to call Canada a home away from home. But that is not to say that living in Canada comes without its challenges. My name is Abdullah Mehio. I'm a Lebanese Canadian. Um, my family started the immigration process to Canada when I was around 10 years old. And I became a citizen at that time and I moved back to Canada permanently when I was 17 for university. Uh, Lebanon is beautiful, diverse, and tragic. Uh, it's beautiful because it has a lot of scenery and a, and a lot of um, uh, historical sites. It's diverse with over four dozen religions, as well as tragic because it's been in political instability since World War II. Since moving to Canada, Abdullah is happy to be away from the political instability, and he enjoys continuing Lebanese traditions, such as making chaboule. I was eager to learn how to make this traditional salad because I've been slacking at the gym, and I think it'll get me back on the health kick. Abdullah mentions that there's some very important steps to be taken when preparing a salad like this. First off, the vegetables. When you're chopping them, you want to be sure that they are as fine as possible. Using a food processor isn't anything to scoff at. They need to be as fine as you can get them. Next comes the vegetables. Now for this salad, you'll want to use parsley as your base, instead of lettuce, which we're traditionally used to. Then comes the fun part that I mentioned at the beginning, the chopping. Now when it comes to the parsley, we can cheat and we can use a food processor. But for everything else, we'll want to use our hands. So we're going to be using some tomatoes, cucumbers, and some green onions. Wash and place to the side, let them dry a little bit. Next is the dressing. We're going to take three to four lemons and squeeze in the juice, and about three to four tablespoons of olive oil. Really, this is up to you, but you want to keep an even level of both. And we're going to bring everything together into a mixing bowl. Add the herbs, the vegetables, the green onions, the whole thing. Add some bulgar, and then add the dressing, and you're done. Now when it comes to serving the salad, you can use pita or romaine lettuce leaves, which kind of act as like wraps or boats for the tabbouleh. It's one of the most unique ways I've had to eat a salad. And a healthy reminder to get myself back to the gym to burn off some of these quarantine calories I've been packing on for the past few months. I hope we can bring people together to share their experiences living in Canada. The good and the bad. Because through both, true change will always be the result. Thank you for watching this week of Project North, and we'll see you next time.